Jan, welcome back to GMA. <laughs> Thank you. It's so nice to be back. Um, medyo nostalgic nung pumapasok ako mm-hmm. anit kanina sa gates. It's been a while, but it's nice to be back. Mm-hmm. Sabi mo nga nostalgic, di ba? Ano yung mga naaalala mo as you were walking dun sa, ano, sa lobby kanina? Ang dami from coming here para mag-rehearse for SOP noon. <laughs> <laughs> Ang daming bumalik na mga alaala. So mm-hmm. talagang, yeah, I was so young when that all happened. So, Definitely. Ah, yun, nostalgic talaga. Ano yung mga fondest memories mo nung nandito ka sa GMA? Napakadami. From um, doing teeny bopper shows, mm-hmm. doing SOP na sa Masayaw, then transitioning to bringing out my acting skills pagdating naman sa comedy for Nuts Entertainment. Madami, madami. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. many fond memories of shooting long nights in the studio. Pero ngayon, hindi na siguro kayo naninibago, no? Talagang Gina Gina talaga ang G- it's show time. Gina Gina sa talaga GTV. ang Yes, you know, super Gina G kami and we're very very grateful mm-hmm. for the warm welcome na binigay sa amin sa GTV. Maraming maraming salamat sa lahat ng tumutok talaga. Mm-hmm. Um, naging very welcoming ang mga kapuso sa GTV. At nakakatuwa kasi no, um, since nung nag-pilot kayo nung July 1. Nakikita natin yung trend. Slowly but surely, mm. uh, tumataas yung trend ng mga nanonood sa inyo. Yes. How do you feel about that? Um, of course, again, we're just so grateful. Sobra kaming nagpapasalamat na parang syempre bago kami. Bago kami sa mga mata nila. Mm. Um, pero naging mainit yung pagtanggap nila sa amin, sa humor namin, sa pamilya din namin na showtime. So, uh, we're happy to have gained more viewers. Mm-hmm. We're happy to have gained a bigger family. So, mm-hmm. we're very, very happy and grateful. Mm-hmm. Kakambyo lang ako ah. Kasi, alam naman natin na ang dami ng pinagdaanan ng showtime. Apo. At ang dami ng mga uh, channels yung umampun Apo. sa inyo. Actually, to, to be exact. <laughs> yes no? po. Um, hindi ba kayo nakakaisip na parang, parang underdog yata kami ah? Siyempre, at one point, sobrang lungkot namin na parang ano, ano nangyayari? Sa, saan na ba tayo papunta? Ito na ba yun? Um, but the thing about Showtime is, as a family, we know that we will never give up in trying to find ways uh, to make our madlang people happy. And we're just so grateful na every time a door closes, there's always someone to open a new door for us. And this time, it was GTV. At sobra kaming nagpapasalamat because it came at the perfect time. Pero nararamdaman yung kapuso love. Sobra naming nararamdaman yung kapuso. Pagpasok ko pa lang dito, <laughs> ramdam na ramdam ko kaagad ang kapuso love. And not only from the GTV and GMA family, but even from the viewers yeah. of, of GTV and mm-hmm. GMA. Sobrang, sobra kaming nagpapasalamat. We read the comments. Mm-hmm. Um, I personally read the comments. And sobra akong nagpapasalamat sa kanila. You think, you know, looking back siguro mga... Five, ten years ago, na mangyayari to? Hindi po talaga. <laughs> I would never have thought the day would come that Showtime would be airing on GTV. Yes. Um, never crossed my mind. I never thought na parang masasabi namin yung kapamilyang kapuso o madlang kapuso. Um, Although I knew na I would always have the opportunity to work with GMA again kasi nakakagawa naman ako ng films na kasama ang ating mga kapuso. Um, but having the whole Showtime family, yeah. I, it was such a pleasant surprise. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Dati nga parang hindi mo, ma- sabi mo nga, di ba, hindi mo maididikit yung kapuso sa kapamilya. Opo. Because there's a big divide, di ba? Pero ngayon, parang, katulad nga ng sinabi ng chairman natin sa Opo. GMA, di ba? Uh, na parang the This network war, the TV war is over. over. Sobra akong kinalibutan nung sinabi niya yun. Na parang, wow, this really is making history, di ba? Um, what, what a time for television, yes. di ba? Kasi parang, this really would have been unheard of 10 years ago. Mm. So, we made history and I'm very happy to be part of this of moment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and let's talk about personal stuff. Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, let's talk about you being mm-hmm. a, a wife and a mom kay, of course, kay Dalia. Kay Erwan. Ah, mm-hmm. uh, ang laki-laki, parang sa ora mo palang ang laki-laki na ng pagbabago. <laughs> ano ba ang mga you. nagbago sa'yo? Marami, you know, becoming 
becoming a wife and becoming a mother, it really taught me to slow down. Mm. Um, kasi sobrang very fast-paced ako, sobra akong workaholic noon. Mm -hmm. um, even more so nung naging mother ako, I learned na parang it's time also to, to prioritize my own family. Mm -hmm. And that's when I learned to slow down and cherish each and every moment I will spend with my family. How are you as a mom? Doting mom ka ba? I know, sobra. you have a, Of course, sobrang... <laughs> yung tutok ka rin sa career mo. Hands-on. I'm a very hands-on mom. Sobrang doting. Ah, siyempre, hindi natin maiiwasan. Lalo na kasi nung pinagdaanan natin na pandemic baby siya, sobra din akong naging praning. Um, but you know, I'm very much enjoying this this whole experience as a first-time mom. Um, sobra ko siyang ini-enjoy and chine-cherish every moment. Sabi nga nila, di ba, walang rule book, walang guide book sa wala, pagiging mom. You have, really have to learn on your own. You learn on your own and I also believe that each mother has their own unique and personal journey of motherhood. So, dapat hindi din tayo nagko-compare. Ini-enjoy mm -hmm. lang natin yung sarili natin version of motherhood kasi we all have our own unique journey. What is the toughest thing that you have to go through as a mom? Madami. It's an everyday challenge Pero, becoming a mother. Dama ko yung madami. Madami talaga. <laughs> and you know what? It, it doesn't stop. Yeah. That's the beauty of motherhood. Kasama doon ang mga challenges. And each each year that goes by, bagong challenge na naman <laughs> yan. Madami. But you know what? No matter how hard it gets, napakasarap talaga mm -hmm. maging isang nanay. Mm -hmm. uh, madadagdagan ba si Dali? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Is it in the pipeline? If it happens, of course, gustong-gusto ko din po mangyari yun. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Bahala na si Lord sa timing na ibibigay niya sa amin. Of course, mm -mm. of course. And of course, Erwan. And of course, uh, Erwan. Sobrang busy si Erwan. How do you find time na kayo ng dalawa? Uh, I think that's also one of the learnings of the pandemic. Parang sobra namin na-appreciate yung time na meron kami. So we really value that time now. We make sure na hindi na rin kami... Parang, we always make sure that we have time. Kasi dati, kasi we're both workaholic. We both have our own different worlds when it comes to work. But this time, we made sure as when we became parents as well, na talagang gagawa at gagawa kami ng oras. Na so actively, pinag-uusapan niyo talaga? Pinag-uusapan talaga. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. So, at saka, we really make time. Okay, so for this month, will we go on a family vacation or in the next? Nagpa-plano na talaga kami ng oh, mga time together. Importante rin yun eh. Opo. Mm -hmm. Yung priority namin talaga ngayon is, mm -hmm. is family. And I'm sure, bukod sa'yo, no, uh, may mga changes din ka or one nung naging... Daddy na siya. Naging daddy na siya. And also, he was growing at the same time in his own personal career. He started mm -hmm. his own uh, production comedy, yeah. company and he was just recently awarded uh, by the James Beard Foundation in wow. Chicago for, mm -hmm. for his work online. So, um, he's also growing in his field of, of work. Mm -hmm. So, nakakatuwa because we've now, parang, I think we've been able to perfect the the perfect time or time management. Mm -hmm. We've been able to perfect time management. Mm -hmm. Let's go to your sister. Kasi, um, yes, ang kapuso kong sister. Ang kapuso kong <laughs> sister. Actually, nung tayo pa lang ng Sahaya, actively, nag-tweet ka na na parang nag-thank you ka sa GMA. Mm -hmm. You're telling GMA na, oh, ang galing-galing ng sister ko. Which is magaling naman talaga. She really deserves yes, it. Yes, she's a brilliant actress. Mm -hmm. uh, Napag-usapan niyo ba na at some point, eh, magkakaroon kayo ng possible project? Definitely. Dito. Sobra kaming open na magkatrabaho together. Uh, it's always about finding the right project para kami magsama. So, mm -hmm. we're just waiting. But sabi ko nga sa kanya, so niya, how was it, ate? How was the, the, the announcement? Sabi ko naman sa kanya, every time people would ask me, sinong kapuso ang gusto mong ma-work? Ma See Jasmine Curtis Smith. So, you know, oh, thank you, Ate. You know, I'm so grateful as well uh, to GMA because they really welcomed her with open arms as well when she came, mm -hmm. when she became a kapusa and gave her such amazing projects. So, possible na siya siguro mag-guest host o mag-host ng It's Showtime? Why not? Masayun. Alam mo, Anne, pinagmamasdang kita kanina pa. And talagang 
you have aged gracefully. Wow. Parang mas maganda ka pa yata ngayon kesa from 10 wow. years ago. Wow, thank you naman. Spill mo ang regimen mo. <laughs> ano ba? Stay happy. Oh. I think yun talaga yung key. Mm. Uh, stay happy. Of course, kasama na doon ang, ang tamang pagkain, exercise if you can, drink lots of water. But I think ang key to staying young and happy, mm. I mean, staying young and fresh is being happy. Talagang yun. Pero, no, you have to tell me, anong regimen talaga? Huh? Like, wala what, kang... what do I actually do? Yeah, like, ano? Oh, just make sure to remove your makeup every mm. night before going to sleep. Um, Sakit ng mga tao na nag-makeup Yes, yun. and one thing that I wish that I learned a long time ago is sunscreen. Napaka-importante, lalo na sa atin na talagang laging maaraw, mainit ang araw. So, sunscreen is is one thing I wish I started earlier. Ako din. Diba? <laughs> if I only do. I have to ask you this. Nag-viral nitong June yung interview sa'yo ng TikToker na si Sean Rizwan mm-hmm. sa New York. Kwento mo naman sa amin, paano ba nangyari ito? Napadaan ka lang ba talaga dito? Yeah, so I was, I was in New York for the Tiffany mm. um, event. And um, I was shopping in Soho and lumapit lang siya sa akin. Tinanong niya ako na, can I guess what your job is? So, ko, yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Ganun lang. And then that's how that interview, it was very organic, it wasn't planned. Um, and that's how that interview happened. I didn't know also that it would blow up on mm-hmm. on TikTok like it did. Bigla na ako ako nagulat na, ha? Ganun na ka dami na noon. <laughs> um, so yeah, it was quite shocking for myself also to see na talagang bigla siya nag-trend. Talagang nag-viral yun, as in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and syempre, alam naman natin, everybody's crazy about you when you're singing. <laughs> <laughs> Maliit na bagay. Actually, hindi pa ako handa niyan. Kapag nag, ano, um, Pag nag-vocalization ka pa. Nag-vocalization ako, mas maganda po yan. Hindi lang po ako prepared. But usually... Maganda uh, na siya. In fairness. Thank you. Medyo mababa yung kuha ko. Mataas po kasi talaga yung range ko. Range ko. Um, but yeah. So, I really think at this point, and I can't... I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Oh, yeah. Since this is also airing dun sa podcast ng GMA Integrated News, I always end the interview by turning the tables around. Okay. Ikaw naman ang magtatanong sa akin. Okay. So, Kuya Nelson. Kuya Nelson! <laughs> Do you remember the first time we met each other? Oh, yes. When was it? Kukwento ko yung totoo, ah. Oh, sige. So, okay, kasi eh. Uh, kalilipat ko lang yun sa GMA. Mm-hmm. Then I saw you sa Rockwell. Okay. And then sabi ko sa'yo, Anne, sabi mo sa akin, yes. Yes. Ganun lang talaga, <laughs> yes. Sabi ko, uh, Tito Nelson, friendly Tito Serge. Ah! Yeah. Ko, nag-iba. And I cannot forget that kasi nag-iba yung mukha mo. Yes. And I really cherish that kasi sobrang organic, sobrang real. Aww. And sabi ko sa'yo, kahit nalumipat ka ng channel, I've always loved you. Oh, thank you so much. And I just like to say, maraming 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 salamat po sa mainit ang pagtanggap ninyo sa It's Showtime family sa GTV. Buong puso kami nagpapasalamat po sa inyo for the support, the love, the kindness that you have been giving us the past. Has it been a week or two that we've been on GTV? So maraming maraming salamat. And... We continue to do our best to not only make our Madlang people happy, but also our Madlang Kapuso happy. So maraming maraming salam.